Hello friends, this is a map of beautiful Lake Powell. Lake Powell is an artificial reservoir on the Colorado River in Utah and Arizona, United States. It is a major vacation destination visited by approximately 2 million people every year. It is the second largest artificial reservoir by maximum water capacity in the United States behind Lake Mead, storing 25,166,000 acre feet of water when full. However, Lake Mead has fallen below Lake Powell in size several times during the 21st century in terms of volume of water, depth and surface area. Lake Powell was created by the flooding of Glen Canyon by the Glen Canyon Dam, which also led to the 1972 creation of Glen Canyon National Recreation Area. A popular summer destination of public land managed by the National Park Service. The reservoir is named for John Wesley Powell, a Civil War veteran who explored the river via three wooden boats in 1869. It primarily lies in parts of Garfield, Kane, and San Juan counties in southern Utah, with a small portion in Coconino County in northern Arizona. The northern limits of the lake extend at least as far as the height crossing bridge. Lake Powell is a water storage facility for the upper basin states of the Colorado River Compact, Colorado, Utah, Wyoming and New Mexico. The compact specifies that the upper basin states are to provide a minimum annual flow of 7,500,000 acre-feet to the lower basin states, Arizona, Nevada, and California. Excuse me. Please comment if you have been to Lake Powell. Continuing. According to U.S. Geological Survey and the Bureau of Reclamation report, in addition to water loss, Lake Powell faced an average annual loss in storage capacity of about 33,270 acre-feet, or 11 billion gallons, per year between 1963 and 2018 because of sediments flowing in from the Colorado and San Juan rivers, according to the report. Those sediments settle at the bottom of the reservoir and decrease the total amount of water the reservoir can hold. In the 1940s and early 1950s, the United States Bureau of Reclamation planned to construct a series of Colorado River dams in the rugged Colorado Plateau province of Colorado, Utah, and Arizona. Glen Canyon Dam was born of a controversial dam site the Bureau selected in Echo Park, in what is now Dinosaur National Monument in Colorado. A small but politically effective group of objectors, led by David Brower of the Sierra Club, succeeded in defeating the Bureau's bid, citing Echo Park's natural and scenic qualities as too valuable to submerge. Glen Canyon Dam was built to solve the downstream delivery obligations of the upper basin states. Lake Powell is an aquatic bank built to fulfill the terms of the compact calls of the lower basin. Construction on Glen Canyon Dam began with a demolition blast keyed by the push of a button by President Dwight D. Eisenhower at his desk in the Oval Office on October 1, 1956. The first blast started clearing tunnels for water diversion. On February 11, 1959, water was diverted through the tunnels so dam construction could begin. Later that year, the bridge was completed, allowing trucks to deliver equipment and materials for the dam, and also for the new town of Page, Arizona. Concrete placement started around the clock on June 17, 1960. The last bucket of concrete was poured on September 13, 1963. Over 5 million cubic yards of concrete make up Glen Canyon Dam. The dam is 710 feet high and the surface elevation of the water at full pool is approximately 3,700 feet. Construction of the dam cost $155 million, and 18 lives were lost in the process. From 1970 to 1980, turbines and generators were installed for hydroelectricity. On September 22, 1966, Glen Canyon Dam was dedicated by Lady Bird Johnson. Upon completion of Glen Canyon Dam on September 13, 1963, the Colorado River began to back up, 
no longer being diverted through the tunnels. The newly flooded Glen Canyon formed Lake Powell. 16 years elapsed before the lake filled to the 3,700 feet level, on June 22, 1980. The lake level fluctuates considerably depending on the seasonal snow runoff from the Rocky Mountains. The all-time highest water level was reached on July 14, 1983, during one of the heaviest Colorado River floods in recorded history, partly influenced by a strong El Niño event. The lake rose to 3,708.34 feet above sea level, with a water content of 25,757,086 acre feet. Thanks for listening. Please subscribe for the best maps and for the love of Lake Powell.